Now, I was really lucky with this. This is a, a Linemar atomic reactor model steam engine. Um, Japanese, made in the 1950s. Um, you do see quite a lot of these on eBay, but generally the, they've got parts missing because this, this top part of the reactor here, this just lifts off. Um, and so does the door for the battery housing. And quite often the boiler, which is this bit here, uh, there's only tin plates that so they rust through. But this one seems to be in excellent condition. I haven't checked the boiler yet. I'm just keeping my fingers crossed on it because the rest of it is in is in fantastic condition. Um, but uh, yeah, these are a bit unusual. Um, there are a couple of filament lamps in here, which are moved when the uh, firewheel is going, and then you put a battery in this housing, and that lights them up, and they flicker. So it's quite an interesting toy. Um, and, just unusual um, so I'm very much looking forward to getting this running I'm not going to do an awful lot to it there is some rusting to the base and the handrail supports and so I should probably clean up the boiler um, but uh, that'll be it really just a good clean and then we get it running it even came with the original can of sterno fuel that amazing there's even some still in it so, yes, I am looking forward to running this. Well, I think you can tell that the, um, the Linemar Atomic Reactor mold steam engine has responded very well to a bit of spit and polish. Um, the boiler cleaned up very well. Um, so did the base. Um, there's still a little bit of corrosion here and there on the base, but it's definitely only minor. It's not worth attempting to strip it right down and repaint it because most of the paint is actually in very good condition, as you can see here. You can see some corrosion. There's a little bit of rust down in there, um, but this all cleaned up very nicely. Um, uh, yeah, it, it did. It just cleaned, it cleaned up very well indeed. Um, I've put some water in the boiler and so far it seems to be watertight so obviously we haven't heated it up yet but uh, um, we, we, we will do that uh, and um, hopefully this should be a runner but it does look very nice doesn't it uh, you could you can see this appeal this but this would definitely appeal to the kid to the kids of the time when this was made I think these were made in the um, 60s 70s I think I'll need to check that I'm not really sure but uh, yeah, it's an interesting. These are interesting, uh, interesting models. Um, yeah, and they are built down to a price. Um, obviously, there's a lot of plastic used. Um, but uh, no, I, uh, I'm quite looking forward to uh, to steaming this. Um, so uh, let's do that right now. Well, here we are. Um, the original can of Sterno didn't really want to play ball, so I've got a couple of mammoth fuel tablets, solid fuel tablets in there, providing the motive for heat. And I think we're, we're pretty much there, actually. That's nearly there. There's obviously something burning off on the underside of the boiler because there's quite a lot of steam smoke and that coming out from underneath, but uh, yeah, I think it's going to run. <coughs> I'll give it a minute. Certainly trying. Oh god, those those uh, mammoth fuel tablets do stink. Right, let's see, we'll be there yet. Yes, I think we're going. Yeah, we're going. Right, let's see if we can get some lights on. <coughs> and there you see it. The Limar Atomic Reactor model steam engine in all its glory with its little flashing light. We'll just turn the other lights off and see whether we, that will come out better. Oh yes, look at that, isn't that amazing? Obviously, you couldn't respect this for anything else other than an atomic reactor, could you? Because they all have that little red light that bounces up and down inside. Anyway, it runs, that's the important thing. <coughs> Let's just turn this around a little bit.
Runs very well actually, and, uh, and very quiet. Well, there you go. <clears throat> That's the uh, Linemar Atomic Reactor model steam engine. Done the steam for the first time after it's clean up and polish and um, going like a trooper. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little video on this uh, rather nice 1950s, I believe, or 1960s model steam engine from Japan. Um, thanks very much for watching. Cheers. <laughs>